Question 9. A non-singular n by n square matrix then A satisfies this equation. No numbers. It's just matrix algebra, which is really quite trivial. Show that A cubed equals some multiple of I. Well, first thing I would do is I would take that and get A. Well, A is going to be I minus the inverse of A. And if I want to work my way up to A cubed, I would just start with A squared, which would be A times that. So that's A times I, the identity matrix is equivalent to multiplying by 1 with numbers, so it just leaves it alone. And the inverse multiplies the actual thing to bring it down to the equivalent of 1, the identity matrix. And then A cubed would be A times A squared. So that would be A times A minus I. So that would be A squared, which I already know. And A times I is just A. So A squared turned out to be A minus I minus A, just courtesy brackets, A take away A, that disappears and you're just left with negative I. So A cubed turned out to be negative I. Now who does it want the answer expressed? Bam, 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 where is it? Show that, so I always used to do something like this. So that's in the form A cubed equals KI, because it says state, where K is negative 1. There, that's question 9.